hello YouTube uh, this is Isaac again doing a quick video on how to use the Presonus Studio Live mixers with your iPad connected to your MacBook or PC whatever you use as computer um, what I'm gonna be showing you of course you're gonna need an iPad you're gonna need a computer a mixer Presonus mixer a firewire cable so the mixer can be connected from uh, to your laptop and also also you're gonna need some sort of a, a wireless a device like some sort of a router wireless router um, so you can connect your um, your iPad uh, your your computer and then connect your iPad to your computer wirelessly now there is another way you can do that which is to create a ad hoc uh, network from um, between your computer and your iPad but for some reason that never worked for me so if it works for you try it but if not you're gonna need a wireless router to make it work okay so um, let's get started the first thing you wanna do is of course create a network if it's already created like I do um, you would go of course to your computer and click on the click on the little wireless thing right here, the little antenna, and then select the uh, the network you created. Like I did, I already created that. Uh, and there is a password on it and all that. And then you'll go to your iPad. You'll go on settings, and then under Wi-Fi, click on Wi-Fi. And from there you will choose whatever network you want to connect on once you're done click on the little arrow right here so you can get the the stuff that you need there should be a bunch of numbers in their IP addresses and all that without those numbers you won't be able to connect to the uh, um, mixer uh, studio live remote won't be able to connect to your computer so you have to have those numbers in their IP addresses All right. once you're done with that go on to your computer click on the uh, universal control bring that up you can open your virtual studio you know like I said you go on to your computer open universal control bring in your virtual studio and then go on to your iPad I'm hoping you did that already uh, which is you downloaded uh, the SL remote remote app right here and then when you get here you're gonna have two options you're gonna have the demo a version which is where you would go and learn about each uh, individual mixer or you'd have the devices online as you can see here my my mixer this mixer right here is online all I have to do is click on connect and here I go I'm connected it's just that easy now I'm gonna go on the overview here on the overview you're pretty much looking at everything this is all 16 channels right here and the masters the master uh, bosses and the ox bosses are up here you have to click on that little thing right up here let me show you click on this and then it'll show you the master boss ox 1 ox 2 ox 3 ox 4 from here you can select the channel let's say I want to play with channel 1 I can click on channel 1 select it this is my compressor as you can see my um, limiter here my EQs right here everything is right here now when you're controlling a channel also you can uh, make it to where you only see that channel which is the uh, channel zoom uh, feature in the um, software right here you click on the channel and then you just uh, switch your iPad from landscape to uh, portrait and that will take you into this channel zoom in the channel zoom you have everything in front of you the gate the compressor EQ and then the accents right here right here you can send it to the axe effects a effects B limiter high pass filter and everything right here mute post face can, uh, cancellation and all that you can do right here and if you want to switch to another another channel you don't have to leave the uh, 
portrait you can on the side here you can select whatever channel you want let's say I want to go to channel 6 or channel 7 I click channel 7 and now I have channel 7 in front of me let's say I want to go to ox 1 I can do the same I can select ox 1 right here now just so you know on the portrait when you select ox 1 it's not gonna be the the sense it's only gonna be uh, let's say you put a gate on the ox 1 you're gonna be able to control that compressor EQ and whatever a high pass filter limiter mute whatever you, you wanna do but you won't be able to send any signal from there to ox whatever you have to be in the channel mode to let's say I wanna send channel 1 to ox 1 I have to come to channel 1 and then do that now if I switch back to landscape it's another it's a different thing now if I wanna send things to the aux mixes all I have to do I have to come here click on aux mixer and bam right here I have um, the world every every channel here available for aux 1 I wanna go to aux 2 I click on aux 2 select aux 2 I can do the same here I can do all that aux 3 I can do the same now just so you know um, I am actually connected to my mixer so whatever I do here is being done on my mixer also just watch see as I uh, move a fader here you're gonna see faders moving you're gonna see faders moving here on my oh, it seems like I'm disconnected or something but anyways let's see here uh, so everything here everything I do as you can see here everything I do on my iPad is being done on my a mixer and also on my computer I'm gonna play some music real quick so you can see what I'm talking about now I got music coming in to the mixer as you can see here signal coming into the mixer and signal coming into the iPad alright well this is pretty much it like I said you have to have uh, a connection you have to have a, a wireless signal connecting your iPad to your MacBook or computer whatever you use and then you need to connect your PC to your uh, or your uh, Mac, MacBook to your mixer via a firewire cable and then create a connect create a network from whatever computer so you can connect to your iPad and once you do that you go then alright if you have any questions please uh, leave me a comment or send me an email thank you alright bye bye